Today's subject, slavery and freedom. You think about this, houses of worship for religions, are they free? Do they actually have a working tabernacle, sun disc, or monstrance, or the device that was used to create their religion and their religion's leaders use to see an invisible body of light with a head, a torso, two arms, and two legs place itself on a cross to create them in its image while doing the miracles of every religion, son of God, messenger of God, or God? Or does the church, when they get enough money from their congregation to make a working monstrous for their flock and set them free, do they take that money? and spend it on something else, keeping slaves and taking away their freedom.